Welcome back guys, and today we're gonna play some more Cast Crush, and guys, today we're gonna check out our second account, we're gonna play on this one. Like, we took a huge break from this account, like 6 months to a year, but now we're finally back. And where we left off, we were at Castle 5, I think we were super close to getting up to Castle 6. So that is like, let's see... Okay, so like 1000 trophies we've gained since then, which is just insane, that's amazing progress. And I really haven't upgraded that many cards since since then, so I think that's pretty good. That's really good. Right, so guys, today I'm gonna show you guys a few few decks that you can use to actually gain trophies really fast. And this will work out really well for beginners or players that have low card levels compared to your opponents. Because when you have low card levels, it would be much more difficult to actually win games and it would be much more difficult to actually win those late games. So the decks that I'm going to show are rush decks that will work out real well for you. Like with rush decks you can really take advantage of your car levels. And you won't really be that dependent on the car levels itself. So the first deck that I'm going to show you guys is a power rush deck. I made a video on this deck, like, like that's a while back on my main account. I think that was even before the Boneyard was released. And I really like this deck, it's really fun to use and it's very successful as well. So basically what we got here is the crystals, we got the mana crystals, and we got these like high mana cards. So we got the executioner, we got the black knights. So basically what you want to do is that you want to use the crystals, you want to use the mana crystals, you want to get out these high mana cards, and then you want to use the standard to avoid demons, black witches, or just your opponent's cards overall. Then you use these backup spells that we got, we got nature, we got blizzard, and we got rage. Just use that to back up these cards and when those get through castle, it's pretty much unstoppable. That's basically how it is, guys. You'll see when we play a few matches. So we definitely try to take out if we want to. This deck I did use from when I got the crystals, and that was at castle 6, up until where we are right now. And so far, we're working out really well. We get closer up to castle 8. We are like 200 trophies away. So we should be able to get there pretty soon. So the next deck that we got, that is kind of a classic rush deck. We got these low mana cards, and we got catapult, we got meteor and unis as well. I don't think I need to explain this too much, you want to focus on all the lanes, and you want to put pressure on an opponent on all the different lanes. So you don't want to focus on just one type of lane. And that's basically how you do. So I don't think I want to use this deck in today's video, I did use this deck from, from castle 5 to castle 6. Like, we might use that in another video, guys. We might. So, that's basically what we want to do, and these decks, and these decks, they're very successful now in the, in the beginning of the game. And as I said, you can really take advantage of your car levels, because these decks are not that dependent on car levels. And the same principle goes for Reaper decks and all kinds of rush decks. So guys, we're gonna check this deck out. Let's go. Like, we can get real unlucky with our, with our starting hand that we don't get crystals and so on, and we're of, we're of course going to lose a few matches. Like, that's unavoidable, so let's see what we can do. We're gonna wait for the next card, then we could go with the mana troll and then the executioner. Like, most people that I face usually have kind of similar card levels to my, to my main account. Like, that is pretty rare, but they have at least a few levels on me on every single card. So it can be very difficult guys, it can be very difficult. So let's see now. Okay, this is not actually too good guys, not too good at all. We're gonna use that and... I guess I'm ready with the heal spell, do we need to use it? We're gonna use it No, we're gonna wait a bit, wait a bit, and freeze. Okay guys, this is not good at all, we did not get the stun, but we could not avoid his, his push right there. So we're going to lose the early adventure right now in the early game. So we're gonna go into the late game, that's not ideally what you want. Because we will struggle because of our car levels, I think. We might use the Inferno there actually, that might not take care of the demon. We did take care of the demon guys, that's perfect, awesome. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go with that and then we're gonna teleport, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, okay, there we go, super low arrows that will take care of that, that's not ideal guys, not ideal at all. And we can't really defend against the against the black right there. I'm gonna wait a bit actually. I'm gonna wait a bit. We might get freeze. Okay, guys, we did not get the freeze. We're gonna use okay. We might do it. We might do it. Come on, come on, come on. 
And as you can see, my opponent here got a dragon, a level 1 dragon. And I got level 2 epics. I got level 7 rares, I got like level 3, level 4. So now in the late game, we can't really do anything, guys. We can't really do anything. Like, keep in mind that at tournament standard levels, a, a level 1 legendary that is the same as a, as a level 4 epic. So we are way behind right there. But still, we're not doing too bad, honestly. Okay, look at the lane right there in bottom lane, guys. Look at that lane. Black Knight, Mud Elementals. What do we do? Okay, let's do like this and that. That's not going to work. Obviously not going to work. But at least we put up a great fight, guys. I think so, I think so. So let's use that. And it's over, guys. It's over. Alright, so we took the loss right here in that game. Let's see if we can take the next one. Like, we might get the uh, only loss today. Who knows? Like, that's pretty much how it is in this game. Like, you can lose 5 games in a row, you can win 5 games in a row. So, you never know, guys. Okay, let's see. I think we're just gonna go with that and then Executioner. We can wait for the next card, but that's not really going to help us. Because we know that we can't play the Black Knight. Okay, so already this guy got out of dragon, guys. And a level 2 whole knight as well. So let's wait a bit. We're gonna use the freeze. We have the end giant growth on that. That will be difficult to take care of. I don't even think my small troops right there. Okay, so it comes running with the same deck that we are, guys. Look at that. So level 2 black knight versus level 2 hollow knight. So let's go like this. Okay, we took the Hollow Knight, but we can't take care of the dragon, guys. Teleport, teleport, teleport. We saved it. But that dragon, that will just do an insane amount of damage, guys. Like, if only we had a rage right now. It might actually save it for us. Perhaps cast a win too, but we don't have that in the stick. Damn, that's, that's a tough game. But there is so, even with my opponent here, that dragon can be kind of a similar deck to us. Kind of a power rush deck. And you could just see how successful that was. I actually think in the in the other video I made with the, my main account with this deck, I actually had the giant growth for in that deck. So I guess I could have that. I do have that now. Not really that high level. I'm gonna remove rage. But I might have to try it out. Okay, so let's see. And I think we're gonna go with the with the demon. Okay, the storm, storm angel. Can this be kind of a rush deck too? And Phoenix, okay, we're just gonna heal that up. Kind of a waste to heal up the demon, you could say, but... Okay, no. Okay, so Reaper. But with the with the natural deer on the demon, we did take care of the... Of the Phoenix and the Angel, now we took care of the Reaper as well. Okay, so good, we can get out the, out the Black Knight, and so far it's looking pretty good for us, I would say. I think we need to defend that. And we know that our Inferno cannot take care of the level 1 Archer Queen. I need one more level on that, I think. Maybe two. Okay, so let's go like this. And we need the Freeze, guys. We need the Freeze. And there we go. And we froze this Metamorph as well. That's awesome. So now we got two Black Knights out. We got Standard Bear as well. We got the whole Knight with Giant Growth. So it kind of helped us a bit right there. We're going to use the Inferno on that. Get another Inferno. Head with that. And I think we got this, guys. I think we got this. And it's gonna try to get the whole night there. We can't go to my castle. That's not going to work. And we got the victory right there. Awesome. So we got the decent amount of trophies as well. Let's gonna start unlocking that chest. We need six more victories for the victory chest. So we're probably not gonna get that today, guys. Just gonna do a few more. Like, this is not gonna be a too long video. Okay, this is not good, this is not good, because now we don't have the crystals, we don't have the mana scrolls. Let's see the next card, come on, come on, come on. And we got the Inferno. So this might be really bad for us, I'm just going to move the Black Knight for now. And we got the mana scroll, alright. Okay, so I might as well use that, and then probably the Executioner. So, so far my opponent is not doing anything, he's not played a single card. 
He's going to play the arrows, right? So not sure what he's running with. Maybe overtime. But yeah, this rough range. You can't really expect your poem to run with kind of a kind of a classic deck or I guess you could say okay that was bad. That was bad. Because people at this roof range just run with so random decks. But it really seems like it's running with a with the overtime deck, like just so defensive we got like the Black Witch, Inferno, Arrows, Demon. And you got the mage, okay, so let's just no, okay. Take care of that and then Oh no. That was bad. And you got level eleven Orchard Tribe. Eleven. Okay, so hold on a bit, hold on a bit, wait, 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 and like that. And teleport over here. My executioner could not take care of the archers, guys. And they got the demon for that, or the black witch. Like, it must have such a huge disadvantage. That's really sad. Let's just go like this. Take care of that. And this. Okay, so that Black Knight, that's going to do a bit of work. Let's go like this. Okay, so we got Black Knights now versus all these skeletons. And we need to take care of the Spectre as well, but we got super low castle love, so we need to deal with that in the top lane. Did not get the Inferno, that's unfortunate, and guys, I think we're gonna lose this one. Like, this is just super tough matchup. But that's how it is, that's how it is. So... We lost that one, we lost that one, we're gonna go again. Okay, now we're a bit more lucky, we got the crystal, we got the mana troll, that's awesome. So, let's see now, next card, we got the demon, alright. So we could go with the mana troll and then the, the executioner. But I'm just gonna wait for the next card, we might get the mana troll, we did not get that, of course. Okay, so the shaman. And keep in mind that I don't have a single egg in the card, so... Okay, so obviously, going to have the real shaman there in the top lane, or the mid lane, my mistake. Okay, so let's go like this. No, let's play as the black knight. Okay, so the mud is... Okay, look at this, guys, we're gonna freeze. Hopefully, don't have a gust of wind. We're gonna raise that up. And it's out. And our shaman, one hit, it's out. And now, angel. There we go, it's out as well, guys. So now we got the awesome push right there with the black knight. I'm ready with standard Do we need to use it? And okay. Well, I used it anyway. I was not sure if the black knight would have taken care of the black witch, but of course it would. So, guys, look at this right now. No, we really can't deal with that at all. We got the Black Knight, we got the Stand and Burr, and that's going to do an insane amount of damage. And that's just a prime example of how you can win with other level cards. Like these rush decks, they can be crazy strong, guys. So let's do a last battle, guys. Hopefully, we can get a victory. Come on now, so crystal, right, right, right. Really got nothing useful now in the in the starting game, like Blizzard, Inferno, Stanabur. Okay, so we got the execution, let's see the next card, it's going to go with the Angel. Okay, so we got the Black Knight, I'm just going to use the, the Man Troll and then probably go for the mid lane, I guess. Yeah, we have the, the Blizzard right there. If it's going to back up the angel, of course, and it's likely to care of my executioner. So what do we do now? Okay, so Reaper, we need to be faster with the Inferno, so we can protect it. It's going to miss the protection. We do not even use the protection. So let's go Demon. Okay, we defended that pretty well. So if he's running with a Reaper deck, we should be pretty fine right now in the late game. But as I said before, you can't really know what your opponent's running with here at the lower castles. But it really seems that it's running with the Reaper deck, classic Reaper deck. 
So let's say now I'm gonna go with this and black knight. So now we got two black knights. Oh no, we didn't have the lightning there. Completely forgot about that. Okay, so now we got the black knight there in the bottom lane. This lightning took care of my my black knight. So that just shows how strong core levels he got right now. And I didn't really pay attention, but this guy's actually a level 10. So that is really high. Mess level 7. Guess we can go like this and then freeze. We're ready with heal spells. We might have a no lightning, but I'm gonna go with heal spells. Right, so took care of one of my executioners, we're gonna go with the freeze again. Come on, can we do it? Okay. That fast, fast, fast. There we go, there we go. Nice. Dark Angel, go out. No, it survived. What do we do? What do we do? And it's lightning to care of my seizure, guys. Our push, that's out. That's gone. And we used our free spells. We do not have Gust of Wind. Okay, Black Knight, I guess. And it teleported that. Wow, guys, what a game. Like, a play with these card levels really shouldn't be down here so low in trophies. Like, that's just crazy. So guys, let's go for one more, hopefully we can get this victory. So guys, as you can see, even with low card levels in a rush deck, it can still be very difficult for you to actually win. Especially against overleveled opponents. But this is like your best chance to actually win against these like overlevel players. Okay, so let's see now. Okay, so Blizzard, I'm gonna get the Black Knights. Okay, so the Boneyard, what can we do against that? We really can't do anything against that right now. Nothing. Let's see, Excursion maybe? Demon. This is a bad game, yes. This is just... Okay, I guess Demon. Like, we can't do anything. This is just terrible hand, guys. Terrible hand. Just forget about this game. Forget about it. You didn't even see it. This didn't happen. Forget about it, okay? <laughs> Alright, but guys, I have to end the video right here. You did see that we struggled quite a bit now versus our opponents, but still we did very well versus some of them. And we managed to win a few matches as well. So guys, if you want to try this deck out, definitely do so. High core levels, that will definitely help you more. Of course. But this deck that will work for the lower card levels, keep in mind that I did get from castle 6 and up to castle 7, almost castle 8 with these cards and with this deck. Right, but guys, this is it for today's video and guys, I will see you next time.